hi everyone and welcome to codingjust.com as in this video i will show you how you can show track on google map from your application so as you can see here i have already created the ui and uh, as you can see we have to edit text and one button for get direction so what i will do if i enter my location where i am right now and here i i will enter my destination where i want to go and if i click on this get direction button so we will open the google map application for from this application by using intents and we will uh, if we uh, we will check if the google map application is not installed on mobile so we will redirect the user to the play store to install the google maps okay so let's get start our tutorial and you will find the uh, source code link in the description this is the xml this is very simple xml you can uh, type it down if you want so pause the video and type this code and if you want to if you want all the sources so you can find link in the description so i will uh, initialize all my edit text and uh, button so i will just simply type private edit text edit text and i will name it et et uh, from location so this will be where uh, i'm right now and uh, from location are you are right now and the uh, second edit text will be for to destination where you want to go et to location okay you can name it anything you want and here we will add a button so a button and i will name it btn let me import the button so we imported the button get direction get direction get directions or get direction okay now what i will do uh, i will initialize these variable and let me close this i will uh, zoom it in okay so first of all et from location and it will be equal to ndv or dot id et from location and uh, et to location this will be the destination area text okay and uh, et to location okay and here we will initialize our button so button get direction and uh, ndv this is the shortcut for find view by id and uh, btn get direction now we will uh, add a click listener on our button so simply type btn now get direction sit on click listener pause type view inside this curly braces uh, first of all we will create two string so user location and we will get the edit text value for from location where from where user want to go so get text text and it will, i will convert it to string and the second string will be uh, user destination okay so user destination at to location and we will get the text text from here okay not this text and convert it to string okay first of all we will check if the user enter uh, these two values okay so this is a simple form validation here i will check if if the user location dot equals to empty string or user destination so equals to so what we are doing here we are checking these two variable if uh, one of this variable is empty so we will not process we will show a toss to the user please enter the your, your location and destination so simply type toast toast and please enter your location and destination you can you can show any message you want here to the user and in the else what we will do in the else we will redirect the user or we will open our google maps application from here so i will call a method here uh, get directions and i will pass uh, user location and uh, user destination so below here i will create this method now simply type private void and get directions and i will pass two string here in the parameter so one from two this will be the user location and this one will be for the destination two okay uh, this will be from from where user want to go and this will be the two this will be for the destination 
okay and here inside this uh, method i will add a try block here and inside this try block i will first simply add a uri or uri here so simply uri uri dot parse and here i will parse the uri so it will be something like https double forward slash www dot google dot com and forward slash maps dir directions and here i will concatenate my from variable here from and i will add a forward slash for to this will be for the destination okay and i will close this okay so we created our uri so the application will we will pass this uri to the intent below so i will create an intent and i will name it intent is equal to new intent and the intent will be uh, intent sorry uh, intent intent dot action view and we will pass our uri here okay and i will set a package to this intent so intent dot set package and the package will be for the google maps application in our android phone so the package is com dot google dot android apps dot maps so this is the pack uh, the package for our google maps application which is uh, which is installed in our android phone okay and last thing is i will set a flag here so set flags and uh, it will be something like intent dot flag new uh, flag underscore activity underscore new underscore task okay and we will simply start our activity and we will pass the intent now what we will do we will uh, add a cage block here and inside this cage block i will pass this exception exception uh, activity not found exception and i will name it exception and when this ex exception comes and uh, this activity is not found so it means that when the user device has uh, not the google maps installed so we will uh, throw this exception and we will redirect the user to um, play store to download the google maps application so i will just simply uh, copy this two line because this will be the same but we will change the uri so the uri i will use this uri so this is the google maps and this is the google play so i need this url from here and i will paste it here okay i will remove this and i will paste it here so this is the play store uh, google maps uh, url and here okay not here sorry below here in the cage below so i will just simply type it okay and uh, what we will do we will set the intent flag so i will just simply copy these two line and we don't need to set any packages okay and i will just simply copy this okay and now uh, i can run my application and i will run my application okay guys so our application is started and now i will add my location i am right now in islamabad and i will just simply type marban this is my hometown location and i will click on this get direction so hopefully it will open the google maps and it is opening the play store so let me check what is the issue okay uh, google map google.com https from okay uh, we need to add a forward slash here okay um, after this dir direction okay so let me run the application again and uh, now it will work i will enter islamabad Mardan. okay and uh, let me close this keyboard i will click on this get direction and now it will open a google maps application which is installed on my device And it will take some time so as you can see here it is showing the track look uh, track line here on the google map so if i click on this preview so it will show me this track from here and 
this is how you can uh, open Google Maps from your Android application and redirect user to Google Map and show the uh, location track on Google Maps. Okay. Uh, so that's it for this video guys and if you like this video please share this video with your friends and also make sure you are subscribed to my channel and the bell notification option is on so you won't miss the upcoming videos